haven't made an appearance in like forever. People want to see you in the video. I'm gonna have Bernie come in too. Say hi. See? He's nice old man. I promise I'll put you right back, okay? Say hello. Say my name is Bernie and I'm a pretty princess. Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome to another vlog. I just got done with a workout for the first time and also forever. This is the third day in a row I've worked out, so we're back. I don't want to say too soon because I feel like when I say that I'm back, then there's like extra pressure. I just have to keep making the choice to be back each day and then I can stick to it. That's kind of how it is. A lot has happened the last two months. I had gum grafting surgery done, which was kind of a disaster but everything healed up fine it's actually still healing the experience was just definitely not great i just wish i would have went somewhere else but other than that we're good we survived that bit what else is new oh i'm going to california in like two and a half weeks yeah i'm going to do a what i'm bringing to la video and also a pack with me for la video so i want those two videos to go up after this one. So that's the plan with that. Ordering things like crazy from Amazon, trying to find outfits and like just all these little things. I have never flown before, so I have had a lot of preparing to do and a lot of gathering of items and like getting stuff organized. The whole thing, you know, that goes along with traveling. So yeah, if you've traveled a lot, you probably have it down, but like with this being my first time, I'm like, I need this, I need this, I need, literally just wanna like prepare and like get everything so you don't have to stress about it. <laughs> and so I'm the type of person that wants to know what's going to go down. I wanna have a plan, I wanna be prepared. I'm doing what I can to make sure that I'm pretty dang prepared, at least fingers crossed. Okay, I'm out of the shower. I already put everything in my hair and I've been clipping my hair up recently like while it's wet because it seems like if I keep it up for like an hour or two before I go to bed because I always wash it at night it helps with it being frizzy like if I let it air dry it like down for some reason it gets frizzier this just seems to be working for right now so I'm gonna keep it clipped for a while but I just used this body butter from Primly Pure it's the almond vanilla one. My mom is using this now too. I got her a jar and now she's like, I think she's hooked on it. So she she had me order her another one. And then I've also been using the Primely Pure deodorant. This is the Blue Tansy and then I got the Tea Tree one. I like it, but I don't know if it is gonna work for me yet. So I'm still testing it out. By the way, I put on this super old ratty t-shirt because I'm going to do a liver pack tonight. I started seeing a holistic slash naturopathic doctor. I'm not even sure what her title would be. Like I saw her once, but I've been actually like on the supplements that she prescribed me for just over a month now. So everything's still like super brand new. I'm taking like a handful of supplements and I've also started doing a liver packs three times a week. And I'll show you what that is. Castor oil stains your clothing. So I always wear like stuff that I don't care if it gets like an oil stain on it. So <laughs> this old Target shirt is gotten in handy. This is the queen of the thrones castor oil. This is so good. I've also been, well, I just started last night, but I have, I bought these organic cotton socks from Amazon. They're the Maggie's brand. They're so comfy, they're so warm. I wanted to get organic material because I just started putting castor oil on my feet and then putting socks on, like before I go to bed. So this is so good. Castor oil, you guys, I feel like I should do a whole video dedicated to castor oil. It's actually blowing up right now. Like everyone's on the castor oil kick. There are so many videos, YouTube videos, Instagram, like. TikTok, I'm sure. I'm not on TikTok a ton. Everyone is talking about castor oil. If you're not using it for one thing, you gotta use it. It's good for so many things. But for what I'm gonna do right now is I'm just gonna put some on my feet as like moisturizer and then I'm going to put socks on. Yeah, so I've been doing castor oil packs three times a week. I've been putting a heating pad over top to help the absorption. I don't know what the heck but the first time I used the castor oil pack, I only used it for 20 minutes, like I was told to, but I felt kind of sick, kind of ill. I don't know if my body was detoxing 
or what, but I used it and I just, I went to bed that night. Like I just felt not really nauseous. I just didn't feel good. I really don't know how else to explain it. So weird. But then the next time I used it, I didn't feel the same way. Like I felt fine basically, you know, and I've never experienced that after. So it was just that first time using it. I've been on a skin journey. I'm like literally hitting everything at once. I'm not even kidding. If anyone has any better ideas on how to do this, let me know. I've been knotting my shirt with a hair tie because like I said, this is messy. So this is a castor oil pack. I ordered this from Amazon. This is the Queen of the Thrones brand. So this is organic cotton, but this is like a very pure piece of material. So that is what you want when you're going to be using a castor oil pack because the castor oil will pull whatever is in the material out and like it's going to be absorbing into your system. So you wanna make sure it's as pure as possible. So what I'm gonna do is put like a tablespoon or less, you don't need a ton, probably a little bit less than a tablespoon onto the castor oil pack. And then I'm gonna wrap it around my abdomen, kind of like where my liver is, and then it's gonna cover like the surrounding area. I don't know if you guys can see this okay, but basically I'm just gonna pour like that much, which was, I don't even think that was a tablespoon. I feel like it was less. Once that's on the pack, I'm just going to wrap it around like this. I don't worry about like having the ties like on the side side of me. As long as I can just get it secure right away, I just bow it. Now I'm gonna go put a hot compression on it for 20 minutes and sit on the couch and drink my tea. Just got done with breakfast. Before we have coffee, I wanna show you the vitamins that I've been taking. I'm just gonna let you know what I'm taking and why I'm taking it, but I'm not going to go into detail about anything else because honestly, there's a lot involved, okay? Man, just the supreme. I am taking this for lymphatics, blood flow, and WBC, white blood cell. I'm also taking ox bile is to help with fat digestion, proglyco, for blood sugar and a nutrient support. And then I'm also taking this PC for cellular support and skin health. I take a teaspoon of this. I also take a teaspoon of this Perfect Press pumpkin oil for cellular support as well. Isn't it so good? I'm going to do some really simple skincare. I was even debating whether to wash my face, but my face is dry. Like, I have a dry patch right here. I'm going to cleanse it, and then I'm just going to put a really simple moisturizer on top. This is the first time I'm going to be doing my makeup for like, over two weeks. I kind of want to film a video today too, separate from this one, all about what I'm bringing to LA, but we'll see. Did I even mention I'm going to LA for work? It's a work trip, work slash brand influencer trip. It's kind of businessy, but it's also like just gonna be really fun to like get away and bond with everyone and meet everyone in person. It's, it's yeah, it's gonna be really great, but I don't think I mentioned why I'm going to LA. It's not like straight up vacation, it's just. It's more like a work trip, but it still seems like a vacation. You know what I mean? It's time to do our makeup. I'm filming on my phone because it's just so much easier right now to get like a good angle. <laughs> Otherwise my camera is like down low and the angle is facing upwards and it's just not like straight on. So we're trying this. This is the first time, like I said, putting makeup on since I've had my skin treatment so it's going to be very interesting i'm using og's sculpted complexion stick in poplar for the shade 
and then OG's blender brush to blend everything out. I'm trying to use up copper. This is so empty, but my <laughs> Q-tip gets in there and I can get product out still. Tomorrow we're going with mom and dad to Chinese and Rapids. I haven't been there since I was like 19, so it's gonna be really fun, I think. We used to eat there all the time when I was young. It's the China Palace. Dad wanted to go out to celebrate going to LA. So I had to take my pullover off. It was getting hot in here. So I just, I just did a little bit of contouring. I just like to use it up like completely. If I can get like more product out, even by applying it with a Q-tip or something, I will do it. I hate wasting. I'm trying this new technique where I brought my bronzer my contour stick down here. Oh, yeah, I'm not mad about it. I think it looks good. So now I'm going to do some blush. I'm gonna to use Topaz. I'll have all these linked down below uh, for you to check out. And if you want a 15% off discount, I will leave my code as well that you can apply at checkout. You can also shop through my link too, and you don't have to apply a code. So that's also always going to be in my description box. I just love doing my makeup. I haven't done it in so long. It's just so fun to do. And then I am going to curl my eyelashes. This mascara is currently OG's newest launch and it's so good, you guys. I absolutely love it. My mom loves it. I'm looking for a tank top to go with those slacks that I have for LA, but I don't know. I might try it on. We're back from the store. At Target, I tried on a button up from a new day and there was a stain on it. So I ended up ordering it on target.com. So that's on the way. I should have a shirt to go with my slack. So I'm really happy about that. And then just picked up like a few other things from Target. Like I got some huge chocolate, some like feminine products, soap, just random stuff, a spatula. Yeah, I have a cauliflower crust pizza. So it's a little bit healthier than like a normal one. So I think I might do that if I get hungry. I'm not like super hungry right now, but I also got some Simple Mills chocolate chip cookies that I'm really excited to try. I also wanted to show you guys the rug that I ordered from Ruggable. I love it. I love the color of it. It is a scary color because we have cats and we've already had an accident or two on here, but nothing Folex. I just got Folex, can't claim. So. Yes, it's been good, but no, seriously, love this rug. I am kind of getting hungry now, I think, so I'm going to put the pizza in. A burrito, you just ate, like, when we got back, dude. Come here. Say hello to everybody. Say hello, aren't you cute? Aren't you so cute? You're just so cute. What are you doing, babe? Are you hungry, too? I know you are. You just take after Fritter like all the time. If he's hungry, she's hungry. Like not always, but like he gets her going. She could be sleeping and then he knows we like get up and come in the kitchen. He runs in here starting to meow and then wakes her up out of her beauty sleep and then she thinks that she needs food too, right? <laughs> it's a little crooked, but it's just a cheese pizza and this is cauliflower crust. Pizza is literally done to perfection. I thought it was overcooked, but when I took it out, I'm like, oh yeah, this is beautiful. Take a look. I think it's perfect. So we're gonna cut her up. If I don't see you guys yet tonight, I will see you in the morning.
Yeah, let me see what it says. An enjoyable vacation is awaiting you at a fabulous resort. <laughs> Where am I going? This was my. I guess. I guess that's pretty good. Chinese was a success. The next video that goes up will be what I'm bringing to LA. The following video after that will be a pack with me for LA. So then I'll kind of go into more detail with like how I'm packing, exactly what I'm packing, because I may add a couple more things to my luggage, kind of do more like organizational type stuff in that video. I hope you guys enjoyed this really chill vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, I will see you in my next one. Bye.